Here are our breathing exercises. If you've already been through this video, please take note just below the screen. I have marked where we actually start the breathing exercises. This first portion is for those of you who haven't done them yet or would like a review. I'm going to go through everything we do in the breathing exercise. I'll walk you through all of it so you know what to do for every single part in here. And then we'll go through it. Okay? So first, we have open throat. For open throat, it is just that. Open your throat. Don't let everything close. Don't let it get all tense. Keep it nice and relaxed, open, standing or sitting up nice and straight. Because if, if you're leaning back on something and putting pressure on yourself and you can't take in a full breath, and that'll slow you down. That'll make it harder for you. Okay? So for open throat, have an open throat, nice and relaxed. Open the jaw. When you breathe in and you breathe out, it's just like you're trying to follow up a mirror. Okay? That's how we do it. When we breathe in, you'll breathe in all the way. At the end, we start with in for three, out for three. When you get to the end of that third count, you should be trying to expand those lungs as much as you can. You should be completely full. Your tank of air should be completely full, and you should be trying to add just a little bit more to it. Okay? Same thing for in for two, out for two, in for one, out for one. Okay? For this, it's the same thing. You want to make sure you expand those lungs, you get them filled up all the way, and then try to add more air into them to expand them even further. Okay? First, we're going to demonstrate how to do the open throat. In three, out three, okay? You can pick a tempo. If you have a metronome, you can pick any tempo. I have a metronome with me here, and I will set that so you can hear it, and, we'll, and I will stay with that for this video. But if you feel confident to do the breathing exercises by yourself, you can set your own tempo, okay? But uh, the tempo I will use is 108, and I suggest you don't go any slower than that, okay? So first I'm going to demonstrate the in three, out three, okay? Here's my tempo. I'll be in for three counts, out for three. I'm going to stretch when I get to the top. I'm going to push it all out when I get to the bottom. So here we go. In and When you breathe, you don't have to do this with your hand. I'm doing this so you know what to do. We're in, two, three, out, two, three. Notice. My shoulders are relaxed. I'm standing up nice and straight. When you breathe in those three counts, make sure you stretch all the way. <sighs> feel those lungs stretch. You can feel the rib cage expanding. All, all the muscles up there working because they're expanding like they haven't expanded before. When you blow out, blow all that air out like you're trying to fog up that mirror. <sighs> blow it all out. Don't have any of that reserve air left in there. Blow it all out so you can take in all this fresh air and you blow all this fresh air out just as quickly. We will do this five times. Then we'll do it in for two, out for two, five times. Then in for one, out for one, five times. When we do any of these three, you're moving the same amount of air. So the air I move in three counts. That's how much air would move in one count when I get down to it. I'll do the same amount for two, same for one. So, same tempo, I'm gonna do it in for one, out for one. Okay? Same amount of air. If you do this exercise correctly, you will get lightheaded at some point. When you do that, sit down and relax. Just breathe normally. Take shallow breaths. Don't try to keep doing this exercise while you're lightheaded. Because that will increase the chances of passing out or getting dizzy and falling over. We just don't want to get hurt. Okay? So, take this safely. Okay? The next thing we do, immediately after we get done with our breathing exercises, is we go right into hissing. Okay? So, we're doing an in one, out one. <clears throat> Notice I did a couple things. I did an in one, out one, and as soon as I got done with that, it's right into hissing. There is no downtime in between. So I did in, out, in, out. And I started hissing for 12 counts, like it says. Now, when you're doing hissing, the last four counts of any breathing exercise, whether it's hissing or balloons, which we're just about to get to, make sure the last four counts are a crescendo. If you listen to how I just did, I did that. I hissed for, I breathed in for two counts, I hissed for 12 counts, and the last four I crescendo. Listen, I'll demonstrate it one more time. Okay? Notice, when I take those two beats worth of air in, 
I breathe in with that open throat the exact same way that it this. That's why we do this. All these exercises add together. One will help the other. There is no downtime between any of these four exercises. I do in for two, out for 12, in for two, out for 16, in for two, out for 20, in for two, out for 24. There is no break in between. So in, out, 9, 10, 11, 12, in, out for 16, 15, 16, in, out for 20. There is no break in between. If you do this entire exercise correctly, there will not be a spot where you can breathe out of tempo. Every breath from the very first beat till we get down at the very end is all metered. It is all with our metronome with this exercise. Okay? So after we do hissing, we do 2 and 24. Immediately after that, we come back here. The star, if you look at this board, we have the, we have the star right after hissing. That tells you to go back up here. After that, we have balloon exercises. After each balloon exercise, you'll notice there's a star. So after hissing, star, we do all that, balloon, hit another open throat, balloon, open throat again, balloon, open throat again, balloon. Okay? There's a lot of breathing here. If you do this exercise every day, your lungs will be improved quite a bit when you come back to band class or when you join band class. Okay? So the balloons, our next exercise. For balloons, if you notice, it says balloons 2 and 12. 2 and 16, 2 and 20, 2 and 24, same idea as hissing, except we have a break in between. That break is these stars, which means we do the open throw. Okay? So for balloons, same as hissing. In for 2, out for 12, crescendo the last four counts. Your goal is to get all of your air out in however many counts you have. You have 12 counts, get all of your air out in those 12 counts. Don't let it be you know, kind of blowing a little bit for nine or ten counts, and all the rest of it, last two counts, has to be steady. Watch my balloon, you'll see, it'll expand in tempo, steadily, okay? So, I'm going to demonstrate balloon in two and twelve. If you want to blow a little bit of air into it, just to get it started, that's okay. Don't blow into it, it expands, I just blow into it, just so the walls aren't sticking together, okay? So, I'm going to demonstrate two and twelve, and... As soon as you get done with that, it'll be in three, out three. There is no breath in between. So when you get done, it's not... Okay, in three. Nope, it goes right into it. So watch one more time. I want to do balloon two and 12, then I'm going to get right to the breathing. So this is what it's going to be like. I went right into that. Okay, and that's how we do this exercise. After I do five of three and three, five of two and two, five of one and one, I will do two and 16, then I'll do all that again, two and 20, two and 24, and then we'll end with in four, out four. I'll do it a couple times. That'll just be to relax yourself, to you know, get your breathing back under control. Now, I may not breathe every single time. I may stop and talk to you while I'm, I'm doing this, because this is a difficult exercise. If you do this exercise correctly, it will challenge you. It will be difficult. I've done this exercise for many years, ever since I was in high school, and I still get dizzy doing this. If, again, if you get dizzy, sit down, relax, take short breaths, don't slouch down in your chair, be all comfortable. No, no, sit in your chair, sit up straight, just take shallow breaths until you feel good enough again, then, come, then stand back up straight and do it again. Okay? When we do this exercise, we do stand up. There is no sitting while we do this exercise unless you're feeling dizzy and you need a little bit and need a, need a minute to relax. Okay? All right. Now, we're going to start the breathing exercise. So you know, I am using my metronome. It is set at 108. That's 108. That's what my tempo is going to be for this. Okay? You don't need to set your metronome while you're watching along with this because I'll be, I'll be listening to it, staying in tempo, and it should be loud enough for you to hear in this video. Okay? So we are going to run through this entire exercise. If you have questions, just please turn back and review whichever part of this video you need to. Alright, here we go. We are going to start. There's a metronome. Remember, metronome is 108. If you can do 112, 116, or 120, 
that's good, but 108 is a, is a pretty solid tempo to do. Uh, sometimes we'll do 112 during class, but we're doing 108 today. All right, here we go. In three, out three, and in, out. Make sure you stretch, in, stretch, out, two, three, in, out, in, out, and we're doing each one five times, in, out, now two, and in, out, in, five times each. One, and, Make sure you crescendo. In. <clears throat> Remember, this is for 24. And 9, 11, 12, 13. And, and that was it. Like right, out, two, three, in. Right after 24, remember, go right into the breathing exercises. Out, in, out. This is our fifth. In, out, two now. In, out. Remember, five times for everything. In, out, in, out. One more. In, one, and in. Be ready. This is the fourth, fifth, and. In, two, three, out, two, three, in. Stretch every time, stretch. In, this is the fourth, out, in, out, two, in, in, out. Be thinking ahead. We have two and 16 coming up. In, out, in, one, and in. Five of these. And then two and sixteen. Five. In, two, three, out, two, three, in, out. Now make sure when you're blowing up your balloon that you are getting a nice steady air stream the whole way. You don't have any air left over. Alright? Two and in, out. One in, two and twenty coming up. Ready and In, two, three, out, three, in, out. Again, make sure your air is nice and steady as you're going. And in, out, in, out, two, and in, out. Full breath in, full breath out. Stretch every time. In, out, in, one, and in. This is for 20 coming up. 20, ready, and. In, out, in, out. I think we already did 20, but if we did, I'm sorry. Get to do it again, congratulations. In, out, two, three, in, two, out, two, and in, out, stretch, all the air out, in, stretch, out, stretch, in, stretch, out, stretch, in, one, and in, two and 24 coming up, four, five, and In, three, 
out, two, three, in. Sometimes I lose count. It'd be good if you keep count of it. The goal is for you to just set your metronome and be able to do this without someone telling you what to do. Out, two, three, in. Out, two, in, in. Out, in, out. Sometimes we do these breathing exercises. Again, after 2 and 24, that's why I'm doing them now. 1 and in. And here's where I change it up. This is the fifth. 4 in, 2, 3, 4, out, 2, 3, 4, in, 2, stretch, stretch, out, 2, 3, 4, in, 3, 4, 2, 5, and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Control your air. 5 whole counts. Six in, three, four, five, six, out, two, three, halfway. Six in, two, three, four, five, six, out, two, three, four, five, six, and you're done. All right? After you've done all this, then you're ready to start playing your instrument. If you, the, our goal in, in the middle school band is for me to come up, start the metronome, and you guys can start yourselves. We'll have four counts. Four clicks, and we get right into it. It's so be click, 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 in, two, three, out. And you have to make sure you count it yourself. So what you might want to try doing, just use your metronome and count it. Check yourself. Maybe record yourself. See if you are adding or subtracting numbers. Like, every now and then, I may have done like five, uh, six of those or four. Okay? It's your job to make sure you keep count of it and stay just like that. All right? Enjoy.